Hey guys, so for those of you who didn't wish me a happy birthday this Wednesday, how dare you? You missed a monumentally exciting day for me. That's right. I turned 24! Uh -oh. Doesn't have the same ring to it, does it? But on my birthday, I noticed some weird things going on. Things that nobody else noticed except me. And when I thought about it, I realized that these weird things happen every single year. And no one seems to notice their weirdness. We all just accept so it. So here are some weird things that happen on birthdays. Number one, your friends turn into your therapist. How does it feel is all of a the sudden their favorite question. And how does it feel to be 24? Well, I don't know. Everyone tells me that I'm supposed to feel different, but I don't know. I just I just woke up this morning and and I don't feel anything. I, I, don't, I don't feel anything. I don't feel anything! It's like your birthday is one big therapy session. Number two, you get checks in the mail for literally doing nothing. The only reason I can think that that happens, it's, it's supposed to be like incentive to live another year. I mean, think about it. You get money for your mother's hard work. Thanks, mom. Number three, people sing to you. I mean, that doesn't sound too weird, but let me set the setting for you. You sit in a candle lit room while people chant over you. I mean, that's all the happy birthday song is. All the birthday song is, is saying happy birthday over and over and over again. That has chant written all over it. Actually, kind of creepy if you think about it. And it's really like a strange form of torture. I would guess that there are very few people over the age of 15 who actually enjoy having happy birthday chanted over them. It's like everybody wants everyone else to go through what they were forced themselves to go through. Happy birthday to you. Number four. Your phone blows up. <laughs> Number five, the Facebook birthday comment dilemma. This isn't a weird thing per se, but it's been happening to me since 2007, so I thought it might be important. Should I be that guy who just says a generic thank you under every birthday comment he's received? Or should I say something unique under every comment, but that takes a long time, although I definitely want to seem genuinely appreciative? Or should I just only say thank you to the people I actually know, but then I seem like a jerk? Or should I just make a blanket thank you status so that I don't have to spend two hours saying thank you. But does that seem like I'm trying to get off too easy? The mental strain of a birthday boy, it just wears you out. And the weirdest thing of all by far, number six, you blow on other people's food. And everyone's just okay with it. I mean, if you did this on any other day of the year except your birthday, you would be looked at like you had some serious issues. So, there you go. Those are the weird things that I noticed this birthday. Are there any weird things that you noticed that happened on your birthday? If not, that's weird itself. Hey, one more thing. There is a new episode of Messages up on the Blimey Cow channel, so be sure and go and watch that because, not gonna lie, I give some pretty solid advice this week. I will see you guys over there. Sorry, we gotta do it again. <laughs>